Lloyd, everywhere I go, everything I touch, with everybody that I speak, I leave an imprint. I leave a unique fingerprint. I leave a stamp on people, animals, my environment, the atmosphere, and every situation that I deal with. I leave something that is inescapable. The way I act, the way I speak, the words I say, the things I do, the tone and pitch of my voice, my body language, the expressions on my face, all these things leave an indelible print on people's hearts and minds. They don't always remember what I said, but they do remember how it made them feel. And I have a mammoth of responsibility, Lord, as you love each of those immensely. You sent your son to die for them. So I pray that every imprint and impression that I leave on people will look like Jesus. And I, it reminded me, I wrote that for a sermon, but it reminded me on, about what Luke wrote in Acts 10.38 about Jesus, how God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Spirit and with power, and he went about doing good and healing all who were oppressed by the devil, for God was with him. And Jesus was out to do good. He was not out to see what he could gain. He, wherever he went, he made a difference. He did it with compassion and love, not half-heartedly or reluctantly. He had and he has your best interest at heart. He wants it to go well with you and not his own interest. And that's what he expects from us. He wants us, the imprint that we make must be impeccable on people. So Jesus wasn't out to elevate himself, to be enriched, but he was there to heal and save and expand the kingdom of heaven. So everything that we do, even like an imprint, like an eco imprint, that we should only take photos and leave a, a footprint wherever we go, that is what's said to us about the environment, about nature, to be vigilant about the impact that we make. So think about your words, think about your deeds, and let your eco print, which you have physically, psychologically, spiritually on people, let, let that print reflect Jesus. Let it be something that makes an imprint for eternity for the soul of the person you are working with. Because in James 4.17 it says, Whoever knows the good and right thing to do, but fails to do it, for him it is sin.'"